Hello everyone, it is Plays here, back in another video, hope you guys are doing amazing. So, recently we just left off with the Commander panel and another Vibe Game Series tutorial. So, today we're going to be talking about how to make your game VR compatible. Now, it's nothing too crazy, it's just a little script and you just put it in your game and it, it makes your game VR compatible. So, you don't have to worry about anything. But, if you are not subscribed to this channel, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and that post notifications. It means so much to me, guys. We're almost at 9,000 as you can tell and that is amazing. So, I can't wait once we get to 9,000. And we might get a 10k who knows but um thank you everyone and also feel free to join the discord it's in the description now i'm not going to be editing this video i'm going to make this very short and possible as much as possible but um it's pretty simple so basically like i said is you're gonna go to the description and look for the models now uh once you see models it's gonna have a few of the links it's gonna have the netflix nexus vr character model this was made by nexus avenger um and he has all of this and i'm going to talk about all the documentation and kind of just about it real quick um, i'm not really going to show it in vr but this guy nexus is an amazing programmer and he made this open source nexus vr uh, model and what it is is it provides people to import vr into the game really quick now you guys are probably like what do you mean by that um that just means you grab the model put it into service script service and you got it um now he has this whole thing for it but like there's this demo over here i won't put the music on i'll just show you real quick but this is what it looks like it has this really cool character model so basically when a vr player loads into your game it will have a custom menu and also it will play um they can play with their hands their model their character model is going to change into vr mode um and you don't have to worry about scripting anything it's already made for you and if you guys want a tutorial on how to add things like buttons and cool things you can interact with like a vr game i might do a series on that because that's pretty cool but um yeah so there's just all this cool stuff there's a few limitations where sometimes it can uh uh, break or things like that like billboard GUIs are not supported click to cl click detectors touch events all that kind of stuff um, there's all this documentation on it but you guys just have to go and look at where what you really want to uh, figure out how you want to import this your game what do you want to do with it but um, like I said you guys you don't really have to worry about anything it's already made for you and it is ready but um yeah, so just go to the description, grab this model, you can get it right here, or you can search it up in the toolbox. Once you get the model, um, you're pretty much ready, you're just going to grab it, go to your toolbox, of course, in the studio, and you'll just have it right here in the inventory, you'll import it, and it's just going to be this right here. Now, this is the loader, all you have to do is put it in server script service, you could put it in starter player scripts if you want, um, but that's pretty much it. Um, and it has a few things, of course, like configurations, um, you can change this if you want, uh, but I wouldn't recommend changing anything because this is really cool, but that's it you guys just import this script into your game And you're gonna have VR in your game now, um, and that's it. That's all you got to worry about <laughs> If you want more tutorials on this or something about VR in general Please subscribe and comment up and just comment down below and let me know and I can probably do that for you guys But I hope you did enjoy this video. It's just a little quick one I wanted to bring this out to you guys and keep you informed, um, but yeah you guys I'll see you in the next one. Okay. Bye